Uh, good morning, everyone, uh, to my partners uh, from the Manila International Airport Consortium and to all our friends in the media today. Good morning. Uh, it's a, it is my pleasure to welcome you all today to today's media briefing for the Manila International Airport Consortium on the NAIA Rehabilitation Proposal. It is a unique and remarkable occasion to share this stage today with some of the most impactful leaders and influential decision makers behind the most formidable conglomerates, not only in the Philippines and in the region, but in the global arena as well. We are here today because of one shared goal and vision, and that is the rehabilitation and modernization of the Nina Aquino International Airport, or NAIA. The Manila International Airport Consortium recognizes the immense tasks of transforming NAIA to meet the exponential, exponentially, exponentially growing demands of mega Manila air travel not only today, but also in the future. It is because of this that the members of the consortium have pulled together its significant resources, uh, technical expertise, and operational experience to put forward in the EA master plan. Six local conglomerates, the Avoidance Group, the Alliance Global Group, Asia's Emerging Dragon Corporation, or the LT Group, Ayala Group, Phil Invest Group, and JG Summit, or Gokum Wave Group, represent some of the largest and most successful Filipino companies that represent approximately 50% of the total PSE index market cap. All of these companies present an extensive track record in the air transport sector, as well as in operating and delivering Filipino public-private partnerships or PPPs, not to mention leading construction capabilities. Manila International Airport Consortium's global technical and ONM partner, Global Infrastructure Partners, or GIP, is one of the leading infrastructure investors, and airport operators in the world. The firm has about $100 billion of assets under management in infrastructure companies. They are, also, they are one of the largest and most credible airport operators globally, with over 100 million passengers served annually. GIP also has over 16 years of track record investing in airports, delivering large-scale investment programs, which in turn deliver service improvement. Together, these seven names represent a leading airport portfolio with extensive airport operations experience, while serving more than 120 million passengers per year across the globe. London Gatwick Airport, the number two airport in the United Kingdom, which serves around 7, 47 million passengers per year. Edinburgh Airport, the number one airport in Scotland, which has roughly 14 million passengers per year. Sydney Airport, the number one airport in Australia, with about 44 million passengers annually. Clark Airport, the number four airport in the Philippines with approximately four million passengers a year. And Mactan Airport, the number two airport in the Philippines serving about 13 million passengers a year annually. The strength of the Manila International Airport Consortium, however, doesn't just lie in the vast experience and wealth of experience that its members deliver. The Manila International Airport Consortium offers both significant and unprecedented capital and economic value in its unsolicited proposal. Allow me uh, to 
share with you some of the headline numbers that our proposal represents. 52, 57 billion pesos upfront concession payment. A never before seen amount for any upfront concession payment for a PPP in the country, whether solicited or unsolicited. 56 billion pesos committed capital for rehabilitation in the first five years of operations. On top of that, 154 billion pesos in additional capital investments for the long term through 2048. 280 billion pesos from ongoing revenue shares and taxes. 258 billion pesos from net economic benefits such as job creation. This equates to over 805 billion pesos worth of value through a 25 year concession period. The benefits of a rehabilitated NAIA extends well beyond the airport ecosystem, impacting tourism, the economy, and communities within reach. There are over 100 billion pesos in gross value added from tourism activities. We can see over 65 billion uh, in air decongestion savings as well. There are about 152 billion pesos worth of value in increased passenger comfort and approximately 60 billion pesos of value in passenger time savings. Our research also showed that about 65 billion pesos in local jobs in our ESG studies allow for engagement with local communities to ensure positive impact. There is a world of impact that the Manila International Airport Consortium wishes to fulfill with this proposal. Perhaps none are more so important than real life benefits than what a safe, efficient, and comfortable day will mean to everyday passengers and travelers. And so we invite you today to learn and discover what the Manila International Airport Consortium envisions for NAIA, the Philippines' primary gateway to the region and to the rest of the world. Thank you.